Fear Alma again. That's what Monolith tells us in anticipation for Fear 2 Project Origin. Of course, one would have had to have feared Alma in the first place to do it again, and considering the original fear was more irritating than scary, Monolith is asking quite a lot. But then, Monolith has every right to ask a lot because Fear 2 actually delivers. Moments before the ending of the first fear, you play Sergeant Beckett, part of a squad charged with apprehending a mysterious woman. Meanwhile, a sinister board of directors has sent a private army out to eliminate any and all evidence of their evil shenanigans, which includes killing you, the woman, and anybody involved with Alma and her psychic chicanery. Fear 2 succeeds where many horror games fail, by maintaining a legitimately creepy and unsettling atmosphere while also providing violent action. The two really shouldn't go together, but Monolith has found a way to make the shooting and the spooking work together in perfect harmony. The scary hallucinations Beckett endures never get in the way of the action, and while the scares can sometimes be a little predictable, Monolith's pacing is impressive, and Fear 2 is a game that will keep you engaged and enthralled throughout its oppressive, stark and blood-soaked journey. The game looks the part as well, with some of the most believable environments seen in a video game. The elementary school section is particularly unnerving in its realism, and the outdoor stages, showing a post-nuke city complete with Terminator 2-esque ash people, is incredibly stark and effective. The enemies are also well-crafted, and while none of them threaten to join Mensa, they will provide just the right amount of aggression to keep you on your toes. Some of the tougher foes can also be quite intimidating. There are multiplayer options too, involving a number of standard game types that, while not too bad, really don't demand your attention. This game is all about the single-player campaign, and much better for it. From its spooky start to its thrilling conclusion, Fear 2 manages to excite and disorient, throwing in a couple of mech and turret battles just for extra flavour. If you want a genuinely thrilling FPS experience that shows just how powerful linear single-player games can be, then you need look no further than Fear 2. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm off to Fear Alma. Again!